Well, as you may have noticed, some people, the two of us, wearing red today to help raise awareness for women's heart health, which is the number one killer in the U.S. of women. Yeah, and the West Bend High School girls basketball team, they know that well. Their coach's wife died of a heart attack during a game last year. Fox 6's Hannah Jewell joins us live from West Bend High School with the way the community turning this tragedy into something really positive tonight. Hannah? Yeah, the death of Andy Pintons was such a terrible loss to this community. She was so loved here. So it's the goal of tonight was to turn this around, find some good in this, and maybe raise awareness for someone else. We were going to be married 46 years in May. It was a shock to everyone at the end of a basketball game at West Bend High School. As a very active, loving person, I mean, she did a lot for a lot of people. Wife of the head coach, 65 year old Andy Pintons, was sitting in the stands when she suddenly died of a heart attack. No warning signs. It's a roller coaster. You, you go up and you go down, up and down, and, but you try and stay up as much as you can. Longtime teacher and coach Joe Pintons works daily to keep her spirit alive. It's very nice. It's nice to know that she had an impact and that people care. And for us, uh, we just don't want her to be forgotten. Specifically, Andy died of an aortic dissection, a genetic disease that runs in her family. Andy had no signs. We are very healthy eaters. We're pretty much plant based. Uh, she exercised the day she died. She exercised twice that day. Supporters wearing the words Pinton Strong. The girls on the team have come to me and told me, Miss Felber, we, we really want to do this for Coach. I couldn't have picked anyone better to honor. Raising money for research for a cure, although it was too late for Andy. We know it's genetic now in the family. My kids have all had to be tested. Her story is inspiring change. We would like, you know, some good to come of it. And the money raised here tonight will go to the John Ritter Foundation. It's unclear how much was raised, but you can donate anytime online. Live in West Bend, Hannah Jewell, Fox 6 News. Glad to see you still coaching out there, too. Hannah, thank you.